Okay, Virgo, this is Sunny, and this is your weekly for the week of July 27th, 2015. So if you like a reading from me, the link is always in the description box below. And after each video, I always have um, a picture stating where my website is. So I'm still doing um, the two videos for the zodiac sign who receives the most liked and most viewed. Um, so for the most liked video, I'm going to provide that zodiac sign with a reading regarding the career love life and finances and for the zodiac sign who received the most viewed video i'm going to talk about um a detailed re uh, weekly uh pertaining to beginning mid and end of the week um and i will upload those videos friday or saturday um i don't believe i had any visions for you guys did i i feel like i did but i can't remember I did. I saw a triangle. Triangle talks of um, love triangles, infidelity. Um, so it ties into the number three: mind, body, spirit, past, present, future. Um, just I, I do feel like a lot of you like you may be kind of off whack a little bit. I am mean, picking up on like some stress and strain from your auras. Um, I am picking up that this is going to be a really good time for you guys to pray to your God and your angels and to learn more about your purpose within life. Learn more about um, your job and learn more about your soul. Like when I say job, it ties into like your purpose and like why you're here on earth. All right. Really good week for you to ground yourself. Honestly, through meditations. Um, yeah, through meditations or just being outside, feeling soil with your hands or your feet whatever the case may be i am picking up that there's going to be some some new adventures involving a certain opportunity so your career life may get a little bit better for this week you may get a new opportunity um however i am picking up some this is tied into the number three some love triangles involving like friends or like if you are partnered up with someone i am picking up that you need to be open to any new information like if your friend tells you hey i saw your girlfriend at the club last night and she was dancing on this guy um what's what's up like what's going on don't get mad at him don't um just go to her about it because she, you're the one who's fucking her all right and vice versa so don't get mad at other people involved just be mad with the person you're fucking and who you're paying bills with and for okay um yeah don't be close-minded to to any information that you receive regarding like friends being shady or your partner being shady because i am picking up on like love triangles and people coming in to mess things up so be careful about that i am picking up that some of you um yeah your finances ugh. stop worrying about your finances so much virgos i mean yeah i know finances is hard and you know you don't like struggling but it, your finances and your love which is like the main stress that's really what i'm picking up on if it's not finances it's love if it's not love it's finances so just stop it all right think logically open up your spirit to your god like honestly your god and your angels are like hey i'm here like let me help you like stop shutting me out because the more depressed you are and the more cloudy your aura is like it's really tough for your angels to come through like yes angels are really really strong but honestly angels really don't like to be around depressing and mad and sad people they're just like especially if it's an ongoing thing they're like they're like little babies they're like little kids they're like hey i tried to make you better last week why are you crying over the same thing i don't know let me walk away from you so yeah, be careful about that. Just open your mind to your God and just, you know, be thankful for any opportunity that comes your way, whether it's good or bad, because you're still growing and learning from that. I said that to a fellow um, Zodiac sign, but I can't remember who I said that to. Um, so, yeah, your foundation and your household is going to be kind of rocky, you know. Um, but honestly, it's time for you guys to think logically. Weigh out the pros and the cons involving your finances and involving things under your household. And honestly, involving yourself. Cut out certain traits that aren't really benefiting you anymore. All right, you stressing, you being a little crazy man or woman over, you know, certain things is really not going to solve anything. All right, so keep that in mind. Uh, very good time for you to think logically. It really, really is. Don't be jealous. 
towards certain things or like controlling don't try to control shit because it's going to hinder you from achieving what it is that you really really want once again your finances are going to get a little bit rocky um i am picking up i am i'm honestly picking up that there's going to be some sort of compromising or partnership with um, a job really really soon it may not happen for this week maybe next week or the week after that so just you know be open to the time frame rather honestly it really depends upon you like the more you pout and cry over things the less likely you're going to get it which is why i'm telling you to be open to your spirituality be open to your god get rid of this depression because a clouded aura is really blocking you from achieving the things that you want i i said this to a certain a certain dude i said i can't remember who i said this last week but i think i said to the leos but yeah thank your god in advance for any new things that you want uh, say God I'm thanking you in advance for my new car I'm thanking you in advance for this new job that I'm going to love God I'm thanking you in advance for my new home however you're going to have to meet God halfway you're going to have to show him or her that you are capable enough to achieve that blessing and you can hold on to that blessing so just take things seriously and understand that just because things are going a little bit good for you for the meantime you're going to have to continue to work hard for it all right so just be mindful that you're going to have to work hard pretty much all your life and i mean it is what it is maybe you'll relax sooner than later but honestly especially like if you are not in the place where you want to be you're going to have to work very very hard to really gain your dream job that everyone else has okay not trying to be mean i'm just really being honest with you guys um i am picking up that you guys are just focusing on one thing too much and it's really causing you to miss out on new opportunities and new blessings this is signing into the stress i'm not talking about it anymore because i already said it and i don't repeat myself but honestly stop being so naive within certain situations you guys are waiting for things to happen yes i do feel like you guys are hard workers and i do feel like you guys are working um hard to achieve what it is that you want but when the going gets tough, don't stop. Keep going. Keep fighting. Even if it feels like it's impossible. Nothing is impossible. Nothing is impossible. So just that's your motto for this week. Nothing is impossible. So it is what it is. Um, but the message of the week for you guys. Oh my God. Be careful of your depression. This is tying into everything that I said. Be careful of your depression, your anxiety. Someone touched my shoulder. Um please like just just let the bad stuff go be careful of love triangles infidelity shady business people shady friends be careful about that i do feel like this is a test to make you guys stronger like you're like what another test really but yeah so you're gonna have to keep fighting the best way that you can um i do feel like this is this is going to be a pretty good way for you guys to um uh, move from rock bottom but I'm honestly picking up that you guys are just going to be too depressed and too much in your head and too focused on this certain thing that you are just going to soak into that, alright? However, this was going to be a very good time for you guys to set limitations to yourself. Be careful of overspending, be careful of overeating, be careful of your anger, like just be careful of bad traits, okay? Set limitations to certain situations bars but this card is a representation of capricorn which is a fellow earth sign so a lot of you like you may be in tune to a capricorn person um i'm guessing like listen to the advice of this capricorn person like this person is going to give you some sort of honesty or some sort of clarity i'm a capricorn so yeah but also some of you like you may decide to leave um an earth sign person which is capricorn Taurus, and maybe another virgo um because i am picking up some cutting out the bullshit between you and this earth sign person so more than likely you may may be involved with the capricorn whether it's their sun or their rising sign but um yeah just keep your head up you guys like i said nothing is impossible all right say that to yourself every morning every evening every night Please do that. Nothing is impossible. Let's try to have a good week this week, my Virgos. And I will see you guys next week. Bye.